in too hard. Oh, our God. Yeah. Did you say something? Yeah. What? I see you. Did you call my name? No. So I finally gave the iToy a try. As you can see, you don't need a controller. All you need is you. The iToy comes with a variety of games that get you moving and shaking. And it's much better with friends. We had a lot of fun with it for a little while. Oh, that's our intern Kevin, and he had a little too much fun. Sorry about that. Sure, on the outside you look like you're about to have a seizure. And be careful not to get in the way, because you might get injured. If you've tried out all the games, check out the playground area. You can play with bubbles, spiders, leaves, fish. Ooh, look at me. Am I scaring you? You can even make your own 60s music video. Turns out this is a lot of fun after a round of drinks or whatever. And for kids, well, it could be an instant babysitter. What we're really looking forward to is the future. Once games with real depth are made to the eye toy, who knows what we'll get? Maybe a first-person shooter that makes slick body maneuvers to duck out of sight. Or imagine hitting something other than balloons. And while it's amusing at first, some of us slowly lost some patience. Well, I'm pretty sure I gave the eye toy enough attention. It's time for it to move on to its next victim. Yes, I think we're getting the hang of it now.